that fast. It was it was it was super good, but it was a little bit too much for me. I ain't go to sleep for two days after. What is going on in that audio, bro? I'm trying to see if I identify voices. I already identified both voices, bro. Sometimes Meek falls victim to I have to explain myself because they, yeah. be, they be playing with my name. The rumors about Meek Mill and Diddy being more than just friends have escalated significantly with the leak of a shocking audio clip. This audio is rumored to reveal a very private encounter between Meek and Diddy, which supposedly left Meek in distress. The industry has been buzzing with whispers that Meek had become Diddy's new favorite, hinting at a more sordid aspect of their relationship. These whispers have been around for some time, casting Meek as a possible new target of Diddy's influence. That fast. It was, it was, it was super good, but it was a little bit too much for me. I ain't go to sleep for two days after. Meek has tried to deny these rumors and quiet the speculation, but the leaked audio has blasted those efforts, presenting evidence that has stunned onlookers. Meanwhile, Diddy seems to be evading legal consequences, reportedly hiding out in the Caribbean while his business empire in the U.S. is being rocked by legal troubles. Federal agents have raided his property, and his sons, Justin and Christian, have been seen in handcuffs, adding to the turmoil surrounding him. However, the controversy isn't limited to Diddy's legal problems. The focus has also shifted dramatically towards Meek Mill, unveiling his close association with the embattled music mogul. This situation was intensified by startling claims from an ex-bodyguard of Diddy, which seemed to corroborate the unsettling implications of the leaked audio. Meek Mill's rumored close relationship with Diddy has sparked significant curiosity and skepticism within the music industry. The emergence of clear proof of their private meetings has reportedly left Meek Mill emotionally overwhelmed, especially as more people from the industry begin to allege that he received preferential treatment from the mogul. The controversy initially gained traction through a music producer named Lil Rod, who has placed Diddy at the heart of a contentious legal battle. This lawsuit accuses Diddy of sexual assault and ropes in several high-profile names like Young Miami, Usher, and now Meek Mill painting them as potential victims of Diddy's alleged misconduct. Lil Rod's claims suggest that Diddy promised to enhance careers in Hollywood in exchange for sexual favors, with Meek Mill supposedly being one of those who succumbed to such propositions. The unfolding lawsuit has turned into a veritable Pandora's box, revealing a plethora of allegations and insinuations about Meek and Usher's entanglement in Diddy's controversial activities, enough to shock even the most jaded gossip followers. Although Lil Rod's legal filings were cautious, merely hinting at the identity of the victims by describing one as a Philadelphia rapper who had a relationship with Nicki Minaj, online sleuths quickly pieced together the clues. The leaked audio corroborating Meek and Diddy's clandestine interactions further entangles the narrative. What is going on in that audio, bro? I'm trying to see if I identify voices. I already identified both voices, bro. Matching the lawsuit's depiction of a deeply intertwined web of scandal within the entertainment sector. This unfolding saga signals the beginning of a tumultuous and revealing phase, exposing the layers of exploitation, scandal, and so-called special treatments that have lingered in the shadows of the music industry. As rumors about Meek Mill and Diddy spread rapidly, Meek took to Twitter to vehemently deny the allegations. He posted several messages in a bid to clear his name, visibly upset by the claims being made about him. Meek emphasized his determination to confront anyone spreading falsehoods about his involvement in questionable activities with Diddy. Meek's assertive stance on Twitter, where he mentioned waking up to widespread blog coverage and the potential for confrontations, signaled his distress over the situation. Some observers suggested that his intense reaction and defensive posture might indicate the depth of his hurt caused by the rumors. Sometimes Meek falls victim to, I have to explain myself because they, yeah. be they be playing with my name. Speculation arose that Meek's public defense could be influenced by contractual obligations to Diddy, including non-disclosure agreements, NDAs, commonly used by the music mogul to prevent negative publicity. This perspective led some to believe that Meek might indeed be another one of Diddy's exploited individuals. The online community responded strongly, with one person highlighting the seriousness of mistreatment of men and boys in the industry, expressing a desire for legal retribution against Diddy. Others criticized Diddy as manipulative, 
accusing him of secretly recording individuals, underscoring a pattern of behavior that eventually faces consequences. The situation escalated when Meek engaged in an online altercation with DJ Academics, who was covering the unfolding story, reflecting the broader tension and controversy sparked by the allegations and the intense scrutiny from the public and media alike. The Philadelphia rapper Meek Mill was vocal about his frustration, illustrating the strain the controversy had placed on him. The situation then escalated dramatically when an audio clip leaked allegedly capturing a private encounter between Meek and Diddy. This leak intensified the speculation and seemed to lend credibility to the swirling rumors about their relationship. The individual who released the audio provided additional context, alleging that at one of Diddy's parties, the host had spiked the drinks to impair the guest's awareness. However, this person remained sober and alert, choosing to record the sounds he overheard because he was astonished by the events unfolding before him. The repercussions for Diddy and Meek Mill have been severe. Diddy faces a plethora of issues, while Meek Mill confronts the allegations of compromising himself for success. Adding to the controversy is new footage showing Meek Mill in Diddy's pool post-party, which, while seemingly benign, has become another point of contention and scrutiny in the ongoing scandal. Diddy's public admiration for Meek Mill, calling him a king and expressing pride in his achievements, has fueled rumors especially since it was captured in a video that some suspect was recorded right after the intimate moment hinted at in the leaked audio. The internet has been ablaze with discussions, particularly focusing on Meek's response. You deserve it, daddy. You putting in that work. The term daddy used here has raised eyebrows among fans, although Meek Mill himself appeared unfazed by it. The plot thickens as Meek was found following a Twitter account that posts adult content predominantly featuring men, which has intensified online debates about his sexual orientation and motives. Adding to the saga, an old song by Meek Mill has come back into the spotlight with its lyrics about regret and ambition, hinting at a potentially compromising relationship with Diddy, possibly for career advancement. This song has been interpreted as an expression of Meek's internal conflict and remorse over decisions made in the quest for fame and success, aligning with the narrative formed by the recent controversies surrounding him. Meek Mill's journey to fame was fraught with obstacles, including a significant legal battle at 19 when he faced charges related to firearms and controlled substances. His career trajectory shifted dramatically in 2019 when prosecutors dropped all charges, allowing him a chance at freedom and success in the music industry. His rise has been associated with influential figures like Jay-Z and Diddy. However, recent claims suggesting Meek engaged in sexual acts with Diddy for career advancement have cast him as potentially exploited, complicating his public image. The narrative around Meek Mill's interactions with Diddy has divided opinions, with some viewing him as a consenting participant in these intimate exchanges, while others feel deceived by what they perceive as his dishonesty. The unfolding saga of Diddy and Meek Mill's relationship is yet to be fully disclosed, but it's not the first instance of Diddy being accused of exploiting artists. These events shed light on a darker aspect of the entertainment industry, where success is allegedly brokered not solely through merit, but through exploitative arrangements, leaving the exploited too scared to speak out. As allegations mount and law enforcement intensifies scrutiny of Diddy's dealings, it seems his once mighty empire is on shaky ground. The advice to Meek Mill from observers is to openly share his experience, while disillusionment grows among fans about the integrity of the music industry. The situation has sparked broader reflections on the rap scene and the entertainment world's hidden dynamics, leading some to understand parental hesitance towards the industry, with online commentary lamenting the rap culture as a troubling spectacle. Meek Mill is undoubtedly in a complex situation, and it appears it will take some time before the full story is unveiled. The unfolding events have sparked a wide range of reactions, with many pondering whether Meek was a victim of exploitation or a willing participant in his interactions with Diddy. What's your take on this controversy? Do you sympathize with Meek, or do you believe he understood the implications of his association with Diddy? Share your opinions in the comments, and be sure to explore my other videos for more insights and discussions.